All right, all right. Another video, another day, another unboxing. This time, it's an A-OK -okay from one of our really awesome community members. What's up, guys? BJ Kicks here. I buy comics, I read them, and, and, and I review them. All for your viewing pleasure. So if you're new here, welcome. And if you're not, welcome back. Now, on this channel, you see me unbox things. You see me given overviews of the stuff I buy. I do reviews as well. I read everything. I try to anyway. Um, and I do that in videos just like this one. So if you're interested in that type of content, hit the subscribe button, then hit the bell icon so that you're notified whenever, whenever, whenever I post new videos. Now, today we've got what we call an A-OK. -okay. What is an A-OK? -okay? An A-OK -okay is an act of kindness, meaning a gift a gift from someone in the community, someone really cool, right? So today's A-OK -okay, um, has something for me and something for one of you. So very, very cool. Uh, this comes from the homie Kev. Now, Kev is a member of the K-Squad, which is our exclusive private community on Facebook where we talk comics, we talk comics, we talk comic book movies, we talk comic book related media. We post our hauls, we post toys and statues, we post reviews, little mini reviews of books that we've read, and we just like to have a good time. It's a toxicity-free zone. We don't talk about drama. We don't talk about dumb stuff. We talk about comics, and we have fun doing it. Uh, and Kev is one of the more active members. He's always reading really cool indie titles and telling us what he's thought of them and uh, putting us on the game. So when Kev messaged me and said, hey... I got an A-OK -okay coming for you. Like, is it OK? Can I send you an A-OK? -okay? And I was like, sure, that's fine with me. He's like, all right, well, send me your address. And I was like, don't be a creep. But I gave him my address anyway. <laughs> and he was like, all right, well, you got a package coming from in-stock trades soon. And we waited and we waited and we got a tracking number and then we waited some more. And then we got another tracking number because they, for whatever reason, decided to change the type of shipping. And then we waited. Then we waited and then we waited and then finally, finally, we went from label created to package accepted. And it was like, oh, the package is, is, is materialized. And then finally, after some more waiting, it's here. Overall, it's been like a three week saga with this package. In stock trades, I don't know what is going on. I know the pandemic hit you guys hard. I know Diamond just shut down one of their warehouses. I know there's a lot happening right now. But I mean, I got orders from like months ago that haven't that have been picked, but there's no like shipping. Like, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. All right. So, I mean, the moral of the story in stock trades is uh, get it together. Update us. Let us know what's going on. Tell us something. <laughs> but anyway, I got to give a super huge shout out to the homie Kev for even sending this over, for even thinking enough about me. And my audience to say, hey, you know what? I want to share this story with you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and get into this. Now, hopefully, <laughs> hopefully the right books are in here. I know what's supposed to be inside, but let's see what's in it. By the way, um, you should absolutely join our Facebook group, The K-Squad. Like just some amazing stuff happens there. Not only are there AOKs and all sorts of really cool stuff. We have exclusive giveaways uh, sponsored by Organic Price Books. Um, and then we do giveaways that I just do because I want to do them myself. Like, there's just a lot of great things that happen in that group. Shout out to Seth, who is starting the K-Squad Book Club. Um, they're going to be announcing what book they're reading for the month really soon. There's just... The community is great. That's all I can say. That's all I can really say. So, here we have it. Your typical fodder from in stock trades. Oh, except there's something that's pretty atypical right now going on. So let's pull this out. Very weird. So you know how like this got that memory foam? I don't know if you can see, but like this started like leaking out of the package kind of. That's weird. That's really weird. Hopefully none of the books got damaged because of it. Um, let's pull out this piece of foam. This one's cool. All right, and we got the books. We got the books. And of course, my address is right here on top, so I'm gonna have to move that. Um, but yeah, so you guys can see even more of what I'm talking about 
one of these little memory foam packs kind of bursted open. So there we go. You can see that kind of leaking out. It looks liquid, but it's it's pretty solid. So that's interesting. I've never seen that happen before. Well, anyways, what do we have here? Let's open it up. Luckily, there's two of the same thing here. Um, and of course, it's packed with a whole bunch of packing tape. So let's see if we can get to it without damaging anything. This is the part where I speed it up and like make it look like I took like forever or something. All right, all right. Is there a note attached? Is there a note? No note, no note, just a receipt. Um, but without further ado, bang, bang, here we are. This is Monstrous from Image Comics, uh, volume one. This is looks like a deluxe hardcover. Um, I don't have anything on hand to compare it to, but looks oversized. Um, but a very very cool book i know nothing about this series so i'm gonna go ahead and read the uh description it says micah half wolf lives in a world gripped by war and alternate matriarchal 1900s asia brimming with arcane dangers let's do this let's put it let's put it over here uh as she struggles to overcome the trauma of violence and regain her her knowledge of her past she becomes extricably linked inextricably excuse me she becomes inextricably linked to an eldritch monster of tremendous power this link will transform them both and place them in the crosshairs of deadly powers both human and otherworldly this massive edition collects the first 18 issues of marjorie lou and sana takeda's beloved and multiple award-winning comic series plus special extras including never before seen sketches so we got that that's very cool but then we also got this, the same thing, twice. Why do we have two of these? Well, one of these is going to be given away on the channel soon. So I do a bunch of giveaways. I do a K-Squad exclusive giveaways where you join our Facebook group and, you know, things happen and people get stuff. And then I do some general channel giveaways. This one is going to be open to any subscriber of the channel and uh we'll announce how it's going to be given away at a later date but um let's just say you want to stay subscribed you want to pay attention all the time because you just never know what's going to happen you just don't so i guess i should go ahead and do an overview of this one so i'm going to break mine open real quick all right guys here we go one more time like that backstreet boys song this <laughs> this is monstrous by marjorie lou and sana takeda uh let's see let's move this light around a little bit we can get past the mess that is this unboxing pile beside me uh, i just want to make sure you guys can see but yeah this is monstrous i love this beautiful like kind of foil you can't see it unless i there we go you see how that's kind of like shiny there shiny moana shout out um but anyway monstrous book one like i said this collects the first 18 issues i know nothing about this series you guys know i'm a superhero guy myself like i love batman and the x-men and spider-man and and that's my jam right but i'm trying to venture out into indie titles i've been loving loving seven secrets by tom taylor um i love i love i mean i just i like reading good stories like that's it um this this will be like a new a, a new bridge for me. So shout out to Kev because he knew that and st decided to send this to me anyway. So I'm going to read it because it was a gift. And hopefully it turns out that I like it. Now, what am I doing? I'm supposed to stretch the spine, man. You got to stretch the spine out. So let's do that real quick and take a look at this artwork. Let's do a little overview. But I mean, this is a beautiful hardcover. I've never had any of like the, the image deluxe hardcovers. This is great. I mean, it looks beautifully constructed. This artwork is good. It kind of reminds me of like um, 
kind of like Joel Jones, but this looks a little bit more painted and a little bit more three dimensional. Like it doesn't look as flat. I don't. I, it's hard to really say like what this is like. It's like a cross between Peach Momoko and Joel Jones. That's how I would describe this artwork just at first glance. But this hardcover is beautifully constructed. I mean, I'm barely stretched out the spine this one time. And it's got an amazing eye for all you eye people. <laughs> there it is. Um, beautifully constructed. It looks like there should be a ribbon on this, but there is no ribbon. Like there's no like bookmark ribbon, but it's okay. It's totally okay. So let's go ahead and thumb through this artwork a little bit. Um, so chapter one, and here we go. Um, lots of words here, but looks like a quick read so far. It definitely looks like an epic journey type story. Um, was there a, a cat talking? It's a, a talking cat. You got a monster looking dude. She's got a prison here. Got some interesting, like, kind of creatures. It's fire lady. That is a severed head. Sheesh. So there's definitely going to be some action in here. Love that. Oh, there's a sword. We'll fight. That's a great cover. That's beautiful. Um, I'm skipping a bunch of pages at a time because... I don't want to be spoiled. And that's the only thing about doing overviews for a comic channel. Now, granted, there's so much stuff I have to read before I get to this. I'm probably going to forget everything I see here. But uh, I'm not mad at this at all. What is that? A dog lady? <laughs> this is like so far out of my normal reading stuff. Like I use, I read like the, state, the straightforward superhero action stories. We've got anthropomorphic human animal mashups. We got people with fox tails and we got dog heads with human bodies. Um, so I'm definitely going to have to like take my time with this one, get to understand the world building that's here. Okay. Or, or just read this map right here. We got humans, we got ancients. We got cats, we got the old dogs, and we got arcanic half-breeds. What? So, there we go. <laughs> we get we get a little bit of a breakdown. So, this is going to be a series I'm going to take my time with. I'm definitely going to do a review on this story, like a spoiler-filled review of this story. Um, once I finish reading all 18 issues sometime this year. Um, but, oh wow, this gets, this gets graphic at times like violent interesting i'm excited to see how this goes what is going on yeah this book this looks really cool i'll have to ask kev for a synopsis like why he chose this why he wants people to read this book and we'll probably cover it in the review i'll probably bring him on if he is if he's open to that appearing on the channel when we do our discussion. Did this lady just stab herself and a baby came out? That, okay. Okay, I don't know what is going on. This book looks intense. Dog lady. <laughs> Very cool. Very cool. So, this is the book. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to skip. Skip. Let's see if there's some extras in the back of here. What extras do we get? Okay, cool. This is really thick paper. Like, really nice paper. Like, this is... If I didn't say it already, it's a very great quality book. So, we got a glossary of the characters, the supporting characters, miscellaneous objects and terms. That's dope. Um, we have a kind of an afterword or foreword by Marjorie Liu. Uh, we've got some early sketches from Sana. Nice. 
Nice. Very cool art spreads. Love that. I have tremendous respect for artists that can like create something completely new. Right. Like I love seeing character designs in the backs of these books. I love seeing like the process, how they decide, OK, this is what I want my vision to look like on the page. That's just dope. We got a variant cover gallery. Um, these are all very nice covers. And then we got a little bit of a background on the creators, the writer and the artist. Um, very, very cool. Very cool. And we got some maps. So overall, now let's just look at this list of Eisners that it won. Best Writer 2018, Best Continuing Series 2018, Best Graphic Story, a Hugo 2018, Harvey Award, Book of the Year 2018, Best Cover Artist at the Eisners 2018, Best Publication for Teens at the Eisners in 2018, Best Painter or Multimedia Artist in 2018, Eisners, and Best Comic and Graphic Novel at the British Fantasy Awards 2018. Like, it's like every award this book could have won, it won. So even if I'm like, oh, this might not be a story for me, clearly all the critics would disagree. So I'm excited to get into this. Like, I, I got to see now what makes this so great. Does it live up to the hype? Does it live up to all the awards and the accolades that it received? I mean, Kev highly recommended it. So my assumption is that it does, but I can't wait to find out for myself. So I can't wait to read this book. This is going to jump a few spaces in my to read pile. This is definitely going to get read this year. And then this one is going to be given away. Still sealed, still in the plastic. I'm giving a copy of this away, courtesy of the homie Kev. And um, yeah, so shout out to Kev. Uh, make sure that you join the K-Squad so that you're eligible for not just our general giveaways like this one, but all of the giveaways that we do on the channel. Uh, the omnibus giveaways from Organic Price Books, uh, the random trivia giveaways, the me being a goofy person that likes giving stuff away giveaways, um, all of that. You want to be eligible, then join the K-Squad at bjkicks.link slash K-Squad or just hit the link. It's in the description of this video. It'd be below. It'd be like down that way. How do you point? There we go down there <laughs> that's a weird way to position your hand but anyway uh join the k squad if you want to talk comics with us and be eligible for giveaways we don't just give stuff away we have a comic book or the k squad book club where we read a book every month or twice a month and discuss it uh we got a lot of really cool stuff going on in the squad like the k squad is not like other comic book facebook groups and that's really all i can say but I know all the members there can back me up. So if you're in the K-Squad, tell everybody else why you joined the K-Squad in the comments below. But until next time, I hope you saw something you liked in this video. And if not, hey, that's cool. Monsters may not be your cup of tea, but you can always buy what you like. Make sure you read what you buy and uh, be nice to others because kindness makes the world go round. Peace.